Hi everyone. I'm going to demonstrate how to put on a Baskerville muzzle. So this is um, the muzzle that we use at the shelter most frequently because um, it's affordable and it meshes to many dogs faces. Um, so it's very much like a universal good boy fit for many dogs. Um, they do say that it's not like 100% bite proof. So it is not recommended for super serious biters. There, Roscoe goes to play with this toy. <laughs> but um, we use it a lot for training, especially um, just because it's affordable and easy to use. And once a dog is trained to wear the muzzle, you can always, um, switch to another brand. But we like the Baskerville for shelter use and training. So we're gonna show on Roscoe. Roscoe's an adoptable dog at Orphans of the Storm. He used to run away from the sight of a muzzle. He hated it. Um, it's definitely something that a dog does not naturally take to. So conditioning is really important and we did a lot of conditioning with Roscoe and he actually really likes his muzzle from what you saw before he was going up to it, putting his nose in it before he got bored. So a muzzle is something you never want to put on a dog without doing training first because they can really um, not like it if you don't do it the right way. And the whole point is so that they're comfortable wearing it. So. I will show you the muzzle first. This is a size five. It has a head strap and a strap that goes around the neck. So when you're looking at it, you always wanna make sure the head strap is up top, okay? If you put it upside down, it has this little tab that can go to the collar, but that is upside down. So you wanna make sure first that it is the right way. So we use this spray con stuff, similar to spray cheese. Um, you can always put like a little amount inside the muzzle to entice them to come get it. This is exactly how Roscoe learned how to use the muzzle. He loves this stuff. So Roscoe, come here, buddy. Come here, baby. Okay, so. <laughs> put a muzzle on with a toy. Roscoe, come here, come here baby, come on, come on. Now he's farting, look it. All right, so since Roscoe is trained, he kinda is already knows to put his nose in it. So it's gonna go over his face. It's already fitted to him. Cause so then it just snaps. Um, and he is distracted by the peanut butter, trying to lick it all up, which is wonderful. Um, I will show you the fit. Roscoe, hey, hey, Roscoe. So when you fit it to them, you wanna make sure it's not in the way of their vision. It's hard to see since he's black, but there we go. He can still see the way it sets on his face. It's not in the way of his vision. It's not poking into his eyes. Also, he's able to open his mouth. So dogs should be able to drink water and pant and run and play in these muzzles. So to some people, it may look like it's too big, um, but actually, this is a perfect fit for Roscoe. Good boy, Roscoe. Thank you for demonstrating. Um, he, like I said, has had a lot of training to wear it. And can you even see it? There he is. He's a poster boy. Um, he looks great. He's happy. He's himself. And we love muzzles.